Dear friends, I welcome you to the six-week online course on research and publication ethics. In the academic field, we generally come across the terminologies like authorship, plagiarism, copyright infringement, data fabrication, image manipulation, etc. The ethical practice is very important not only when we conduct research but also when we publish the research outcome in terms of paper or article. So we have to follow certain norms and ethics in preparing the articles and publishing the research work. The onus of implementing fair practices lies with researchers, universities and also who publishes it to maintain the academic integrity and credibility. The basic objective of this course is to give an idea on different aspects of research ethics, publication misconduct, copyright issues, citation process, index factors, open access, which are important for research as well as publications. As recommended by the University Grants Commission, the two credit course covers six modules distributed over six weeks. In this particular course, we will cover six modules which are as follows. In week one, we will be discussing the philosophy and ethics. In this module, you will get the introduction to philosophy, definition, nature and scope and also we will define the ethic and ethical practices which will be followed in our research work. In module 2, that is in week 2, we will be discussing scientific conduct. In this week, you will learn ethics with respect to science and research, intellectual honesty and research integrity, redundant publications, scientific misconducts. In week 3, we will discuss about the publication ethics. In this module, you will learn publication ethics, the best practices, the publication misconduct, identification of publication misconduct, etc. In week 4, we will discuss the open access publishing, which is very important in today's digital world. In this week, that is in fourth week, we will learn the open education resources, open licenses, open access publications and initiatives, and open journal. How do you publish the paper in online platform? In week five, we will be discussing the publication misconduct. In this week, we will cover the subject specific ethical issues and conflict of interest. In the last week, we will discuss the sixth module, the database and research matrices. In this module, you will learn the indexing database, citation database, impact factor of journals, etc. The target group of this particular course is the students of MPhil and PhD. As recommended by the University Grants Commission, PhD students may take up this two credit course as a part of their coursework. The course may be useful to the faculties who have started their career. The course has been developed in four quadrant approach and is supported by the AV lectures, the e-text and e-resources will be provided as external link. There will be self-assessment questions or quizzes and the discussion forum. And as you know, the discussion forum is very important component in any type of online course. Through this discussion forum, you will be able to interact with the teachers and peers. Since it is a two credit course, so there will be an assessment. At the end of the program, you have to clear the final assessment to earn the credit. I hope you will have a great learning experience of this massive open online course on research and publication ethics. Thank you.